hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today i thought i would do a little vlog um i was actually planning on doing a get ready with me but a lot of you guys said you'd prefer to see a vlog so here i am vlogging i mean i was gonna vlog anyway it's just that i woke up today and i was like oh my life is just not interesting enough to vlog but to be fair i've got a few things that i've got to do i have a few like new house bits i want to show you so yeah we're gonna do it and also i need to clean the entire house today so i thought i would do like a little speed clean which is very shocking for me i know but the house just needs like a complete clean i do clean it like every week but i haven't done like a deep clean if you know what i mean so i'm gonna do that but yeah i have had a weird couple of days i've been feeling i feel like this lockdown has really hit me like with all of the other lockdowns i've been quite positive about it and i've been like you know we're never gonna get this time at home again like we may as well make the most of it but i feel like this time it's just ugh, i just feel drained from it i just miss seeing my family like honestly i cannot wait to see my family again and i just miss doing like normal things like when it gets to the weekends like i miss going out shopping for the day or going out for food or i don't know going and visiting a new town like there's just so many things that we can't do anymore and i feel like i'm really starting to notice it now and yesterday i had like the biggest problem with my car so i decided i was going to go and do the food shopping yesterday because normally my boyfriend does it but i really wanted to go because i haven't been out of the house like as in i haven't like gone somewhere in my car for like a month like i haven't driven my car for a month and i woke up yesterday and i thought is my car gonna be okay like i haven't driven it for a month and we've had like really heavy snow and ice and obviously you're supposed to run your car in winter so i got all ready to go out food shopping got in went to go out and get in my car and the actual car wouldn't even unlock like even when i pressed the fob like the car just wouldn't unlock so instantly i was like that's weird but i thought maybe the battery in my key had just gone so i just unlocked it using the actual key and the car just wouldn't turn on like it was silent like the, it wasn't even like it was struggling to turn on it was just like it was completely dead but i handled the situation quite well if i say so myself like normally i would panic but i mean i still like called both of my parents panicking but it seems like the battery's dead and to be honest i've had the car for like five years and i've never replaced the battery and apparently you're meant to replace it every like three four years so i've arranged for halfords to come out and just give me a brand new battery so they're coming tomorrow on monday which is good so hopefully that'll fix my car i'm really hoping i got the right battery because i had to like measure it and i don't even know what a battery in a car looks like so i really hope i've measured the right thing so fingers crossed my car is fixed tomorrow and all it needs is a new battery i'm pretty sure that is what the problem is but yeah so that was a bit stressful yesterday so i thought i'd vlog today and it is sunday today actually I've had a very chilled morning today. I've just been sitting downstairs, laying on the sofa, watching YouTube on my TV. And yeah, I've actually had a really nice chilled morning. And I was honestly thinking, you know, I really just, I'm not in the mood to film. Like I've just not been in the best mood. I've been feeling a bit down. And then I was like, no, like push yourself to do it. And now that I've put my makeup on, I've got dressed, I honestly feel so much better. So if you're feeling that same way, like you just feel drained, like you don't want to do anything, just put like a little bit of makeup on, get dressed. And honestly, you just instantly feel like so much more better and like ready to take on the day. Also, if you can hear the guitar, my boyfriend is currently practicing, which he does every single day. And it is very stressful because it's so loud and this house isn't that big so like you can hear it in every single room but yes anyway i think i'm going to go downstairs i'm gonna start cleaning i'm literally gonna clean every single room so i'll do a little time lapse for you um i don't know if anyone would be interested in that but you know i kind of find it interesting to watch people clean and then i can also show you some of my new home purchases which is very exciting i don't want to show you yet until it's all oh my god this door yeah i don't want to show you yet because i need to like clean everything first and then i can show you it i'm really happy with like how far we've come with like actually getting furniture for the house that like, we still have quite a few bits that we need to get but my list is like massively reduced so um yeah there's really not like a huge amount that we need i'm really happy with everything we've got like it all looks really really cute so yes anyway i'm gonna speed clean i should probably get rid of these flowers actually because they are dead but yeah let me show you the kitchen okay this is really embarrassing because it's actually okay it doesn't even look that messy <laughs> it's really not that messy but oh, to me it just 
just needs a clean like you know when you can just tell that something needs a clean yeah i'm gonna do a little speed clean for you gonna do the kitchen the living room the bedroom the bath oh, the bathroom is that one room where i'm just like i just i, I just don't want to do it like it takes so long i'm really annoyed because my boyfriend was going to do it yesterday whilst i went food shopping but then he had to go food shopping so now i have to clean the bathroom which I'm really not happy about, but you know, it's gotta be done. So yeah, also, do you wanna see my outfit today? I mean, it's really, it's really nothing special. Um, I just have on this black top from Primark with these, can you even, that lighting is really bad, with these trousers from New Look, and then this chain necklace is actually from Primark, and so are my little hoop earrings. Uh, also, look at my roots. I'm really, oh, I feel really nervous that they're gonna get out of hand again and it's gonna be like a whole issue trying to bleach them but i hope that i'll be able to go and see my mum soon because we do each other's hair and yeah i mean my hair isn't like desperate to be done but it's getting there you know like it's gonna nearly need to be done but yeah let me show you all of my cleaning supplies i haven't actually i remember when i first moved in i was supposed to show you all of this stuff and then i just forgot but i have a lot of cleaning stuff because basically I was sent a lot of products from Cherries, which is an app. It's almost like an online B&M, like it's really cool. You just download the app and it has like food, it has beauty, it has cleaning supplies. It just has loads of different stuff. And yeah, they gave me a voucher to spend. So I got a lot of cleaning supplies with it. I do actually have a discount code as well. I'll put it on screen. This is one of my baskets. This is more of like my bathroom stuff. Um, and then let me just show you under the sink because it's, actually crazy like these are all the cleaning supplies that we have under here and yeah i mean oh, it's just i found it really exciting when i first got cleaning products but then i realized i was no mrs hinch and now i just really can't be bothered to do it but yes anyway i'm gonna get on with cleaning the kitchen and i'll do a little time lapse for you if anyone's interested the kitchen is actually my favorite room to clean because it's very simple and it's really satisfying where should i put you Oh gosh, I don't know where to put you. Is that too high? I'm also going to put on these ugly headphones to listen to music. They're like wireless, but they're literally the ugliest headphones ever. I mean, but they were only like 14 99 so they're no beats, but they work fine. Wow, I am so fashionable. <laughs> Nothing left, so hold on tight as a hurricane breaks the fence. Stay hidden from the causes that might let go of your hands. Take me away, I'm running for my life, for my life. What's with your delay? You're only killing time, killing time. I've got on to the bathroom the final step um currently listening to high school musical if you can't tell so yeah the bathroom's the final step and i've been having a great little concert whilst going around I really felt like the main character but yeah now i've got the task of cleaning the bathroom which is the worst task in the world so enjoy <laughs> cleaning and honestly i feel so good for it like it was actually really fun like listening to music and i was literally listening to i listened to hannah montana first then i think i listened to high school musical wait did i listen to anything else i think i literally just listened to hannah montana and high school musical but i had a great time honestly felt like i was in a musical i was literally just living my best life and the house smells amazing like everything just feels so much better and i'm really happy that i've done it because now it's like ready for the week and i always think sundays is like the best day to do it because then it's just ready for like the week so yes okay so now i'm gonna show you some of the little house updates that i have my recent home purchases and i've actually bought some stuff that have just like completely changed up the rooms okay so before i show you these so i bought two new rugs for the bedroom and for the living room um because the living room had one in but it was my old one and it had like stains on it and it was really small so i wanted to get a bigger one um but i found this website called irugs okay and i was like this is 
weird because the rugs were so cheap like i got both of these rugs for 50 pound each and for rugs these size like normally you would pay like minimum 100 pounds so i was like okay this is a big risk because i looked on their reviews on trust pilot and they had like two and a half stars and like people were saying that the rugs didn't look like the pictures or like they were really bad quality but i was like you know what i'm gonna take the risk because i'd seen some good reviews i'd seen some good pictures and i thought for the price like you can't really go wrong so they arrived the other day and honestly i am so happy with them like i couldn't have asked for more but yeah i'm going to show you the rug so the first one that i got was for the bedroom and i just wanted kind of like a statement rug that was gonna just go under the bed look really nice so i decided to go for this one and oh, i love this so much i think that it really just makes the room look just like more done like it looks makes the room look so much more finished because i am not a fan of the color of these carpets like they're just too dark for me so yeah i love this rug so much honestly getting it under the bed was a whole thing we had to take the mattress off we had to take off everything we had to like lift it up because this bed is heavy it's huge so yeah i feel like this room just looks so much better now ignore all of my stuff here need to sort that out um but yeah this is the first rug that i got and i think this one was the cheapest it was like 49 pounds but yeah i think it looks really nice in here and then in here okay ignore all of my boyfriend's amps and stuff like that oh my gosh i'm flashing red right i'm gonna have to be quick i got this giant mirror okay so i knew that i wanted to get like a really really big leaner statement mirror um just because i've never had one before and i really wanted to take nice pictures in it and i just think that mirrors really open a room up as well and this is our smallest room it's our spare room um so i really wanted to like open the room up so i got this one and this was from Danelm. it was a hundred pounds um i think it's called the black apartment mirror uh it's just a nice simple one and it's absolutely huge i don't think it's showing how big it is on camera um but i mean i completely fit in it and yeah it's just leaned up against the wall and i just think it's just really nice and then i've also put the rug from the living room in here the old one because i feel like it looks nice in here and then i did also get this mirror yesterday from argos to put next to my dressing table but it actually arrived and it was cracked uh, i was just not having a good day yesterday clearly because nothing was going right for me so i need to return this okay and then in the living room my boyfriend's currently playing <laughs> fifa um this is the rug that we got in here so it's pretty much the same as the last one it's like a shaggy white rug but obviously it's a lot bigger so i read that you're supposed to have a rug big enough that your legs of like your furniture touch it or like go over it slightly because it makes the room look bigger and i actually think that that's really true like it definitely makes the room look bigger um and yeah it's such a nice rug it's really really big and yeah i think that it's just made the room look a lot nicer a lot bigger um we do still need to get a tv stand i might order that later actually because i know what one i want to get and then also need to get an armchair for here um but yeah that's pretty much all of the new home updates i'm actually really hungry i'm gonna make myself some lunch uh i need to put this on charge because you are flashing red i think i literally filmed like an hour and a half worth of footage of me cleaning so I, i'm gonna have to really speed that up i hope some of you found that interesting but yeah i'm gonna make lunch and i think i'm gonna have a mozzarella tomato and pesto toasty and i'm gonna put this on charge Wait. my battery is now charged i honestly really need to wash my hair like you probably can't tell because it's blonde but my hair is very greasy today like it really needs a wash but it is a sunday and i normally have a bath on a sunday and i actually have a lush bath bomb left to use so i think i'm gonna have a bath tonight but yeah what is the time now it's quarter past five uh me and my boyfriend have just been watching lost we're on season two now if anyone's not watched lost get on it it's so good it's on amazon prime we literally try well i would watch like 10 episodes in a row but my boyfriend will like only watch one episode a day it's very frustrating um so when i've not been watching that i've been watching married at first sight australia which i've also been loving that's so good like i've got so into it but yeah i think now probably make dinner soon actually i think we're having sea bass tonight but yeah i've actually started writing a book which is fun it's so strange because last weekend i basically i mean i i get these weird ideas all the time of things that i think oh my god that would make the best film or oh my god that would make the best book 
and I got this idea last weekend and I was like wow I would love to read that or even watch it um so basically I'm writing this book with the whole plan of it eventually becoming a film um you know you gotta set your goals high you know I find writing really therapeutic and I mean writing is my job like it's what I do for a living but obviously this is a different type of writing this is creative writing which I've never actually been the best at I've always been the best at um like journalism like writing articles things like that I've never been the best at writing like creative writing like writing books like in school I was never that good at it um but I still really enjoyed it like it was still I just I just liked writing I was always an English kind of person so yeah I've started doing that just like when I get a chance and I just I just find it very calming like I just I really enjoy it so yeah I think I might do a little bit of that it's a thriller because thrillers are like my favorite books to read and also my favorite films to watch actually but yeah it's been a pretty chill day today um I feel so much better than this morning like I'm so glad I put makeup on I picked up my camera uh it just I feel like so much better for it like it's definitely better to just like put yourself out there and do it oh my gosh Valentine's Day is coming up okay I know my boyfriend is not gonna watch this video because I mean he lives with me like he's not gonna sit there and watch my YouTube videos but I have like this whole cute little like date night planned for Valentine's Day. So I'm actually really excited for Valentine's Day. Let me know if you're spending it alone, if you're spending it with someone, obviously following the guidelines. Thank God we live together now because I don't know how I would have coped because this lockdown seems to be going on a lot longer than the other ones. But yeah, I feel like these days you have to get excited about little things. So I'm really excited for Valentine's Day, really excited for Pancake Day honestly what a great day that is like who invented pancake day because that is genius like the fact that we actually acknowledge pancake day is just amazing on valentine's day i'm gonna get like dressed up as if i'm going out to like a really posh restaurant uh because you know like in my dreams that is what we would be doing who knows when we will go to a restaurant again hopefully soon but where we live before Christmas we were all in tears weren't we and certain places had restaurants open certain places didn't we didn't have restaurants open um so I don't even know when the last time I went to a restaurant was like summer I don't even know but yeah I feel like everyone is pretty fed up this time round of lockdown um but I feel like you know I feel positive I feel like we can see the end people are getting vaccinated my mum's been vaccinated my nan's been vaccinated my dad's been vaccinated my sister's been vaccinated so you know it is definitely happening eventually things will hopefully go back to some sort of normal whatever normal is who even knows what normal is these days I really need to like stop filming myself when I look like the worst I've ever looked but it's just like a habit you know so in case you can't tell I've just got out the bath um oh my god I didn't show you oh my god I'm actually the worst vlogger I was gonna show you my bath because I used a lush bath bomb and it was really pretty oh my god I'm actually the worst anyway I had a lovely bath it was like this really pretty turquoise color uh kind of felt like I was a mermaid like in the sea anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this video I'm actually gonna end this now because I've got work tomorrow it's currently 20 past nine should probably go to sleep early I mean I won't but I probably should it's the thought that counts you know I hope you guys enjoyed the video uh let me know if you want me to do more vlogs and what kind of vlogs you want to see like what kind of things you want me to show like is there anything specific but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.